again we just picked these up in Terrell Texas about 75 miles from home got off home time and uh, sent me over there this is going to Tallahassee Florida got to get it there Friday today is Wednesday and uh, so we got it easy we got one big problem we're missing a light right here so what I want to do is there's a uh, Speedco there in Greenville Louisiana right there at the border of Texas we're still in Texas so I want to go over there those guys are pretty good I've, I've done some they've done work on my trucks on these trucks before so anyway uh, we put 18 straps on this on this load I scaled it at the shipper total weight of truck and trailer with the load is 66,000 pounds so but I scaled every axle we're good and uh, as you can see Every, all of them are twisted just like I've talked to before. But if you look at those right there, see how I have an edge protector on that second beam right there? And the reason why is these things don't feel that rough. They really don't, but there's such a sharp little edge on these things right here. There's just a very sharp edge on there. And over a period of time, it'll cut, it'll cut through that strap. So I had to double them in places right there. And I didn't have enough of my little small four inch that I love so much. So I know what I'm gonna get myself for Christmas. Let's head to uh, Greenville, Louisiana. See if we can't get a light fixed. Later.
Dodge pickup truck. He was pissed off at me because I wouldn't uh, follow his directions up that little uh, sandy hill without going out and checking it first. So I got out of my truck, went up there. He had his hands thrown up in the air like this. And he's like, well, I told you to get up here. I said, hey, I, uh, that looks pretty sandy. I'm going to check it first. He goes, man, I've had 30 trucks up here. They always say that. I'm probably the first truck ever. So always, if you want to protect your safety score, always get out and look first. Don't take the words of these guys. They don't care. Thank you.